Ah, hey, action in the house, juice time. Yes, at juice, at fruits. Here we are at East Life, juicing it up with you with our shot, number one, special shot. And you know, the master ingredient of our special shot is turmeric. And turmeric, look, check that out. Look at that energy. Wow, look at that sunshine in there. We're talking total healing power. We're gonna talk about that healing power. And you know, our master healer, this Shisho. Shiso is a mustard green. And look, look, look at the, the design, look at the vibration, look at that configuration, leaf of power. And to complement that, we're going to use our basil. And not just any basil, this is microgreens. This is like really below the baby level. This is the micro level. This is like, I would call these the stem cells of the greens, but you know, basil is a very powerful immune healer. So here we go, those three together. We're gonna rock them in our juicer to create our shot, our heavenly shot here. And it's a nice, good power shot. So let's go ahead, get our juicer going, put our basil and shiso leaf in there. Follow that with our turmeric and look, look at how that comes out. Amazing, amazing, amazing. So we're gonna get all of that down into the mix and we're gonna give it a little extra, little extra hand here so we get a little sugar in there, a little extra moisture. We're gonna drop three, four, we're gonna drop seven of these seeded grapes. Make sure your grapes come with seeds, you know, the seedless stuff. I don't know, we need seeds to reproduce. So let's keep it seedy. So seven of our grapes with, with seeds, and this is our shot. This is our turmeric shot, but uh, holy <laughs> turmeric, because it's got the holy basil in there. So there we go with the purple basil, rocking it with the turmeric and the uh, mustard green leaf. But not just any mustard, as I say, it's the shiso mustard green. So here, we're gonna trip that off and let's get our shot into the shot glass here. Ay, ay, ay. As we say in Costa Rica, pura vida, pure life. This is the life, immune life vibration. Woo! Love living the life. No, we're gonna back it up. We're gonna back it up with some high moisture uh, fruit juice. So we're talking uh, grapes. We continue with our grapes. And we're gonna show you a different technique of juicing. We're gonna juice with the blender here. So we're, we're going to put our grapes into the blender. We're gonna pluck each one off. So we get that right down into the bottom of our blender. And uh, we're talking, you know, about a half a pound of grapes, you know, a couple of cups of grapes, seeded grapes, give our juice a nice sugar uh, energy because the big ingredient in this juice is going to be cranberry, serious cranberry. But we're gonna water it up. We gotta give it some more water, some more moisture. So we have an exciting fruit here, which is called a water apple. <laughs> That's the name that you would see it listed under in your uh, search engine, water apple. But you know, it's interesting because it's shaped like a pear. So if you don't have water apples, use pear in your neighborhood. So pear juice uh, mixed with the grapes and we're going right into the blender. 
we're just cutting them you know and of course it's called water apple because it's full of water you know and for me this is an excellent source of water so that's going right into our blender so we have two of our water apple in Jamaica we call these OTET apples because they originated from Tahiti <laughs> and of course in Jamaica they're also known as Ethiopian apples so pick your choice but you know uh, wherever you see apples you can always comfortably substitute pears uh, or wherever you soup pears, you can always substitute apples. So talking about apples, we're gonna mix some apples in here as well, Fuji apples. But before we rock with the Fuji, let's create a water base in the blender. So we're gonna blend these two high moisture ingredients right into our blender here. Okay, so. So that's it, we just created a water base uh, to be able to process the rest of our ingredients. So the next ingredient we're gonna put in here is gonna be our cranberries, cause that requires a lot of liquid to process it with. So we have our cranberries going right into the blender with our water base, because now we wanna blend the cranberries down and really break them down finely. That's why we're using a blender instead of a juicer for this particular process because those cranberries need to be micronized and this machine here will definitely do it for you. Perfect, the cranberries are grounded well. Now we're gonna add our apples and grind our apples as well. And besides the apple, we're gonna add our remaining ingredients, which we have, hey, that's a watermelon. Come take a look at this watermelon. But it's not just any watermelon, it's a watermelon radish. So that heavy radish energy, immune power right there. So we're gonna put our watermelon radish, one small one, and you could use other radishes if you can't find the watermelon radish. So don't, don't worry. We're gonna put lemon juice as well. And we're using an original lemon from where we are here in the tropics you know, paradise. See, these lemons have seeds. This is the real thing. The Creole lemon, as they might call them. But these are heirloom lemons, so we're gonna get that seed out, and we're gonna just juice the lemon just like this, using our knife right into our blender, just like that. So our two halves of the lemon, we remove our lemon seeds, out of here okay and lemon juice is ready going right in so we have our heirloom lemon uh, right here thanks to uh, where we are in the beautiful isthmus the only isthmus on the planet that is Panama so Panama Exotica is where we are our apples right into the blender as well so we see how we do this how we make our juice using the blender and very little blending you just want it to really just break down you know fine enough without you know a lot of technology energy so 30 seconds who need to be blending, blending, blending. And the magic here with this is our press bag, our juice bag. So Aris Life is the place where you're gonna find your best juice bag in the world when you're gonna use your blender 
This is what we recommend that you press everything out. Uh, body press, <laughs> not cold press, but warm. The, with the warmth of your body, you know, 98.6 degrees is what you want to be able to put your body press into this and just fill it with your love, you know. So this is why we ask you to do it this way because this is a love juice here. This is a serious love juice that we're putting together for you here. And here we go, get everything into our bag, just like that. Zip the bag up and let's get this out of the way. And we're gonna press just like that, just by hand. Hey. You remember when you milked the cow with grandpa on the farm? It's the same idea. Yeah, we juice the fruit in our press bag, just like this. Yep, warm human body press juice. Pineapple, cranberry, lemon, yes, and apple. Apple, pineapple, cranberry, with that drop of lemon in here, and that extra sweet sugar from our handful of grapes. And we press it tight. So you get your little physical energy in here as well. You just rock it real tight. Oh yeah, real early morning gym here. Kitchen gym, or juice yoga, if I may. Okay, so this is how we do it. We unravel here and we show you what the result is. Here we are. Here is our resulting pulp. So you see all that love, all that energy that we put off into here. We're going to pour it into our vessel here. Okay. So, juice is ready. Here we go. Pure life. What a combo. Hey, me and my shot, my shot with my juice. Pura Vida. Thanks for joining me.